that that you are maybe trying to move to the other side or it's just that you are doing what you are supposed to do? Has it ever well, it could have been. Uh, the thing is, the government is um, the, gov the ruling part, the ruling the government that is ruling right now is Kenya Kwanzaa. I am from the ODM Azimio Party uh, coalition. And because I am in government and because I represent Nairobi County as the woman representative, right? When a function happens in my county, just because the president or the deputy president is in attendance, I cannot shy away or run away. First of all, I want, you to, I want to tell you something. I'm not an enemy of the president. I'm not an enemy of, of the uh, deputy president. I'm not an enemy of anyone that is in the government, all right? So, so for me to be expected not to be here because uh, Rigade Gashagwa is going to be the one launching or flagging of this run is a bit, um, is a bit far fetched and insane. All right, I think we have to learn to breed love, not hate. And when you have an opportunity to show love, then you do it. So I am showing love for all the patients and all the parents of children that have heart problems that require urgent surgery and they cannot afford it. The most marginalized and vulnerable that the Mata Heart Run raises money so that they can be able to provide that surgery free of charge to save lives. Now, if I'm going to be doing something wrong, then I would rather be wrong than be right and lose the rights of my, my own rights and the rights of those little children to have a really amazing good life. So, I, you know, I mean, politics is not about enmity, right? I mean, we saw the insults that Raila Odinga and Uhuru exchanged over the years during the campaigns. Insults that were untold of on social platforms. And in the end, Raila Mwala Odinga and Uhuru Kenyatta came up with something called the handshake. Love rose above hate. So if we are Christians, then we know that God is love. So when you have an opportunity to sow a seed of love, you do it. Sowing seeds of hate are not good. That is not godly. So I would rather be Christian and live Christ-like and sow seeds of love than hate. Love conquers everything. And you know what? When we are divided, we will never thrive. We have to come together. Our national items talks about unity, peace and liberty. So we have to be united. We might have differences, but we have to stay united. So rumors are there that maybe you are moving out of ODM, is that true? Sorry? Rumors are out there that you are moving out of ODM, is that true? Uh, can I tell you something? I am in ODM from 2007. And in 2013, I left ODM and I ran because ODM were not going to field the woman rep candidate and eventually they did. But I went and I joined Peter Kenneth. All right. Peter Kenneth actually invited me to, uh, to his party and I joined uh, Kenya National Congress and I joined Peter Kenneth and I ran for woman rep and then I went back to ODM. So I had a, a little uh, period in between where I joined a different political party. My first political party was Kanu. My second political party was NAC. All right. My third political party was ODM. And I've stayed in ODM and I'm back in ODM and I'm a life member of ODM. And when I decide to leave ODM ever in the future, I will make that announcement. People will not decide it for me. All right. Because I'm a life member and I contribute. I have my contributions every single month to my party. All right. And I'm a life member. So I want to also tell the party that they also have to respect the rights and the freedoms of people. Because Raila Odinga himself stood for freedom of speech. All right. I am entitled to my own opinion. I'm entitled to my own decisions. All right. And I feel the party can whip. Right. But the party cannot demand that you think in only their way. All right. You cannot only think their way because that means I cannot protect the rights of my citizens if I myself have my own rights curtailed. So I retain and maintain my right as a human being right as a leader to make decisions for the people who elected me and those who did not elect me that I serve I took an oath all right for the Constitution of Kenya all right to protect the Constitution of Kenya and for me protecting the Constitution of Kenya means that when the government calls for a finance bill to raise money I stay there I look at it objectively not subjectively